All right, guys, let's talk about the new frontier in robotics because things are heating up big time. We've got some insane developments that are basically bringing us into the future we've all been waiting for. Think humanoid robots and not just as some distant sci-fi dream, but as something that's practically on our doorstep. We're talking mass production, deliveries starting this year, robots that can do everything from house chores to industrial tasks. And get this, these things are going to be direct competitors to Tesla's Optimus, so let's talk about it. First up, let's zoom in on Shanghai, where things are getting real with the first ever humanoid robot factory. Shanghai is about to start cranking out humanoid robots like nobody's business. This factory, built by a local startup called Ajibot, is set to start deliveries in October this year. By the end of 2024, they're aiming to ship out 300 robots. 200 of those are bipedal, and 100 are the wheeled variety. That's not a small feat at all. So Ajibot is no newcomer. They've been working hard in the Lingang Special Area, which is part of Shanghai's free trade zone, since February last year. It's a prime spot for innovation thanks to some serious support from the local government. The company's founder, Peng Zhihui, was actually a genius youth recruit at Huawei, where he worked on AI chips and algorithms before deciding to strike out on his own. And that move is really paying off. Just to give you an idea of what these robots can do, Ajibot recently unveiled five new models at a launch event. These aren't your run-of-the-mill robots either. We're talking about bipedal and wheeled bots designed for a whole range of tasks, from interactive services and smart manufacturing to scientific research, data collection, and even special operations. One of their bipedal humanoid robots, the Lingxi X1, is going to be open sourced in a full stack manner. This means they're publishing a lot of the design material and codes so developers around the world can get involved and push the technology even further. By November, the factory's production is expected to hit 100 units per month and will ramp up even more by December. This is like the start of an assembly line for the future, mass producing humanoid robots that could potentially become as common as smartphones. Now let's talk competition, because you know where this is going. The minute you hear humanoid robots, you gotta think about Tesla and their Optimus project. Elon Musk has been hyping up Optimus as the next big thing, and honestly, the stakes are high. But Ajibot's founder Peng Zhihui isn't backing down. He's pretty much laid it out there that Ajibot is going head to head with Tesla. So what makes Ajibot's robots a contender against the might of Tesla? First off, their flagship model, the Wanjing A2, is nothing to sneeze at. This thing stands 175 centimeters, five foot eight tall, weighs 55 kilograms, which is around 120 pounds, and is packed with sensors and AI that allow it to see, hear, and understand a whole bunch of inputs like text, audio, and visual data. It's designed to be incredibly precise, so precise that it can thread a needle, which is something that even a lot of humans struggle with. Ping and his team are super confident in their commercialization and cost control abilities. They believe that they can roll out these robots more efficiently and at a lower cost than Tesla. Peng's vision is not just about selling robots, it's about making them accessible and practical in a way that hasn't been done before. <laughs> With Ajibot planning to ship 300 units by the end of this year, they're not just talking big, they're actually delivering. But here's the thing, the humanoid robot space is rapidly becoming a new battleground in the tech world, especially between the US and China. We're talking about a market that's projected to be worth over 20 billion yuan, that's about 2.8 billion USD, by 2026. That's a massive leap from the 3.9 billion UN market size in 2023, and everyone wants a piece of that pie. Ajibot isn't going it alone, either. They've got some serious backing from major players like venture capital firm Hongshan, Hill House Investment, and even BYD, which is one of China's electric vehicle giants. With this level of support and Peng's impressive track record, remember, he was pulling in a cool 2 million yuan a year at Huawei before he left, the future looks bright for Ajibot. Now, if you think Ajibot and Tesla are the only ones in this game, think again. Enter Unitree Robotics, another Chinese company that's been making waves with their own humanoid robots. Their G1 model is already making headlines, especially because it's priced at just $16,000. 
That's a fraction of what some of the other bots in this space are going for. Unitree originally focused on four-legged robots, think robo-dogs, but they've quickly pivoted to bipedal humanoids. The G1 is their latest offering, and it's pretty impressive. It's got a visor-like face, three-digit hands, and can do some seriously complex moves like leaping, twisting, and even dancing. In fact, there's a video out there showing it tackling stairs cluttered with debris, jogging, and even resisting a few intentional pushes from one of the developers. This thing is built to perform, and it's ready for mass production. What's cool about the G1 is its versatility. It stands 1.32 meters tall, weighs 35 kilograms, and can fold down small enough to fit in a cupboard. It's got 23 degrees of freedom in its joints, meaning it can move in a very human-like way. On top of that, it's equipped with 3D LiDAR, a real sense depth camera, noise-canceling microphones for voice commands, and a stereo speaker for responses. The battery gives you about two hours of use on a single charge, which isn't bad at all for a humanoid robot. So, what's the deal with Unitree's G1? Well, at $16,000, this robot could very well become the household butler we've all been waiting for. It's not just a gadget, it's a glimpse into a future where robots could be as common in our homes as vacuum cleaners or dishwashers. And with mass production on the horizon, that future might be closer than we think. Now, there is also Stardust Intelligence and their new Astrobot S1, which was just launched on August 19th this year. This bot is designed from the ground up with AI in mind, and it's aiming to be the most versatile, intelligent, and useful robot assistant out there. The S1 is packed with cutting-edge technology that allows it to perform a wide range of tasks, from ironing clothes and sorting items to cooking stir-fry and even stacking cups competitively. It's got a design for AI architecture, which means it's not just about following commands. It can learn, adapt, and think on its own. It's almost like having a human assistant, but without the need for breaks or vacations. What really sets the S1 apart is its ability to handle complex long sequence tasks. We're talking about preparing food, brewing kung fu tea, and even performing musical instruments. It can mimic Wing Chun martial arts and shoot basketballs with the precision of a pro. Stardust Intelligence has clearly put a lot of thought into making this robot not just functional, but highly skilled and adaptable. The S1's hardware is just as impressive as its AI. It features a unique, rigid, flexible coupled transmission mechanism that monitors force transmission in real time. This allows it to control its movements with incredible precision, avoiding accidents or damage during operation. And because it's designed for universal applications, it can be used in research, commercial settings, or even at home. Stardust Intelligence is pushing the boundaries of what robots can do, and they're planning to complete the commercialization of the S1 by the end of 2024. With its ability to understand and interact with the world like a human, the S1 is a major step toward achieving artificial general intelligence, AGI. And given its self-developed components and cost advantages, it could be a game changer in the AI and robotic space. So essentially, the race isn't just about building the coolest robot, it's about making them practical, affordable, and something we can all actually use. The next few years will be key as these companies fine-tune their tech and get ready to launch their robots into the world. For us, it's an exciting time. Robots are becoming more than just machines. They're becoming partners, helpers, maybe even friends. So keep an eye on these developments because the future is happening right now. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like and subscribe and let us know in the comments which robot are you most excited about and why. We'd love to hear your thoughts. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.